Okay. First of all, the Joel Embiid 50 with a Bulls palsy, great. The Sixers won that game. Knicks are still up 2-1 though. Brunson played well. But Sixers were shooting the lights out in game three. And they deserve that win. Okay, on to this game. Same script from game one. Lakers led at halftime. Nuggets systematic, systematically beat them in the third quarter. And they pull away in the fourth quarter. That's basically the game. Here's the worst part. D'Angelo Russell was talking all that shit. And had zero in this game. He had the same points as me. He had the same points as you. Wh whoever you are watching this video. Like, damn, you can't do that. You just can't. What's worse, he wasn't even on the huddle towards the end of the game. Like, come on. Like, really, come on. And then LeBron James that just stat pads his way towards the end. Still had 22 points and 8 rebounds, though. The score doesn't do justice to how much of a mismatch this is. In those final seconds, though, Austin Reeves was just scoring like crazy. It didn't matter much. Davis, Anthony Davis had one point in the fourth quarter. They froze him out again. Crazy. Can Darvin Ham actually coach this team? Golly, I guess not. Darvin Hogan did it again. That's not gonna work with me, brother. And for the Nuggets, though, whew. Game 3 Aaron Gordon is apparently a thing now. 29 points and 15 rebounds for Aaron Gordon. Michael Porter Jr. is shooting the lights out once again. 20 points, 8 of 16 shooting, and 10 rebounds. Jamal Murray had 22. And Jokic, man, like... 24, 15, and 9. What a masterful performance by Jokic. The Nuggets are about to sweep the Lakers. And my delusional ass thought this Lakers team had a chance. I guess not. But hey, see you guys in Baraka, Lakers. You deserve it. See ya.